Hello everybody, I'm here in the Minecraft so-called 2.0 leak and I did something pretty cool so here I am in one of my creative worlds that was something I was experimenting with, I was working on stained glass but um Anyway, oh, darn, darn bats. What I made is a silent kind of player detector trap. It is kind of expensive to do in uh, survival, but I just think it's it's cool because. Usually when a trap is activated that for an explosion, you hear the TNT goes off, go off and you have to either prevent the player from escaping or else they're, they're going to run away. Or you just have to hope that they don't have uh, sounds enabled. So this is what the trap looks like. I put a pressure plate right here so it just appears as if you open the door, step on the pressure plate, and it automatically closes the door. Which activates this, which allows things to pass into the item hopper. Now here we have an iron ingot that's just waiting to enter. Now these these coal blocks have an incredibly long, I think they might be infinite, I'm not sure, um, length of time in which they are burning. So put this in this gold block, gold ore, and it will not activate because of this iron ingot. Now what happens is when you put up on the pressure plate it allows the iron ingot to enter this hopper turning on the furnace. Now I'm actually going to place a crafting table, let's see, right here And let's cover this up. And let's put the pressure plate there. We'll see how it works. Start by putting myself in game mode, survival. So this is the first I've tested it on in survival. So it, it should, it'll still function the same, but we'll see if it kills me or not. But if it doesn't, then there's obviously certain other things you can do to fix it. Um, so we enter. Oh, there's a pressure plate. Nothing really happens. Oh, door closes. Okay. Ooh, so there's some stuff, stuff smelting in here. Uh, I'll just take this gold ore because I'm lazy. Doesn't really matter. Well, let's look through their stuff. Um, assuming they have a bunch of stuff in their chest. Let's let's steal that. Take it all away. Blah, blah, blah. And while I'm just sitting around here messing with stuff... This is gradually smoking more and more and more. You can see it's not going down. And this is probably one of the the prank features in the 2.0, but I think it's actually pretty cool. Um, cause it keeps smoking and smoking, and if they're ignorant, they're not they're noticing it, and they're just sitting here. More smoke appears. It, it admittedly it does take a very 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 long time, which is one frustration. You'll need a lot of distractions all around the furnace for um, the player to fall for it, otherwise it's going to leave and it looks the trap will occur. But you, you'll want your player next to the furnace, because what happens is when there gets to be too much smoke, and I don't know if Boom. Okay. There's a large explosion, there's lots of fire, things burn. You can probably hook that up with some TNT. Obviously, you saw I didn't actually take damage with it, but um, that can probably be programmed to change. So that explosion will ignite some TNT, which will blow you up immediately because that's the way TNT works. Um, instantly blow up other TNT, and in the long run you die. I didn't die because it looks like they didn't program in damage when the TNT explodes, but I think they should. 
there, there's my beautiful creation burning. So, all right, game mode creative. It's all gone. No stopping it. Ah well. Well, I'll show you how to build it. If you didn't quite catch it before. It's really, really simple. You just have... a hopper facing down on top of that. Well, it can be really facing any direction. A furnace, just shift-click that on top. Put a torch here. There. And your pressure plate. Hide your stuff. Just like that. And put in your ore. Whatever you want. Um, shoot. Build up your house around it. Let's actually put that there. Oops. Dang it. I'm a noob. I'm playing on a key keypad. But you get the point. That's all the same stuff I did over there. You saw me put it in there and you activate it. The resultant goes into the hopper. This starts burning eventually explodes. So, I think it's a pretty cool trap. Um, so a lot of really cool stuff you can do with it. And I r as much as it was an April Fool's joke, I just think it has a lot of potential to be used in the actual game if it were, if it's to be added. Because, I mean, exploding furnaces, that's just... I just think that a that adds something to survival that's not normally there. Adds a bit of challenge, even if it only happens on hard mode or something. Anyway, that's my silent trap. Silent explosion trap. Hope you enjoyed it, and have a great day.